God bless you. Good morning. It is Saturday morning, October 15, 2016. Had to make a video today. It is getting interesting. What is going on in the world and in our atmosphere? I uh, had a wonderful email come in that just put me in one of those wow moments. And I thought I would share the information with you to pray about. And also a heads up, uh, it seems like things are beginning to really come to pass. Uh, got an email from Lori on Friday at 2.42 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. She says in her title, statement the lord gave you after the first wave you will be off the grid paul bigley interviews mike around the world and your translation to your, your translation is here <clears throat> so i opened up the email it says confirmation of this vision maybe some of you remember uh, the lord gave me a word as i was just going to my bathroom walking through the house one uh, about a month ago which i've got those dates i'll share those in a moment it's very very interesting the dates you know it's the way it's the timing when things happen how we know what's going on and uh about a month ago i was walking around the house and the lord said after the first waves hits get off the grid and I thought what in the world so anyway um, I was like praying about it because the Lord has given me a lot of visions over the many years and I was thinking well it could be this it could be that <clears throat> I did not know exactly what it was the Lord was talking about I had some ideas in my mind but we always leave these things open on the table for the Lord to bring uh, to pass his definition of it and it could be multiple definitions by the way not just one um okay confirmation of this vision Lori says mike around the world states that we just had a magnetic wave and another is coming the end of december take a listen and she puts the link here which i'm going to uh pass to you god bless you Lori. For the person who keeps, then she's quoting James 2.10, for the person who keeps all of the laws except one is as guilty as a person who has broken all of God's laws. There is a way that appears to be right, but in the end it leads to death. Proverbs 14.2, Jesus Jesus's offer of salvation is for you today. I love this, how people put these tags in their emails. You know, I, I highly encourage it. I just think it's an awesome way to be a little silent witness that people are going to scroll down and they're going to see those messages from the Lord. Okay, I want to get now to uh, this, this particular date, which is interesting because let's see, Friday... Let's go check this out. Friday happened to be the 14th of October when she sent me this. That's interesting. Now let's look at these dates. Okay, so we go to the executive order. The executive order was came out from the White House coordinating efforts to prepare the nation for space weather events October 13. Now, Let's go to the video that the Lord gave me. The original one was September 13. And then I did a follow-up video on September the 14. The September the 13 <clears throat> video, Holy Spirit warns, when the first wave hits, what to do. And then on the September 14, Holy Spirit off the grid, California earthquakes, waves, waves, bombs, etc. The end times. Okay, so we go now to Pastor Paul Bigley's uh, video, which just happened to come out October 15, which is today. The President of the United States just issued an executive order of upcoming apocalyptic space weather events also helps us uh, spread the word he says uh, regarding all of these things so uh, what Paul Bigley said 
is that the White House released this executive order 12 hours before uh, BP Earthwatch captured a wave of energy that literally took down, collapsed the magnetic shield around the Earth. That's interesting. And what the email that Lori sent me said is that Mike around the world states that we just had a magnetic wave and another is coming the end of December. Another is coming. And that's what the Lord was telling me when the first wave hits, what to do to get off the grid. When the second leading us to believe that there is more than one wave. So this is interesting, this magnetic wave, but also the fact that the Lord did this video, this first one, September 13, 2016. He, I released this video. And if we look at the executive order, it was October 13, the exact 30 days exactly after the Lord showed me this. The uh, White House comes out with this. And then 13, what did Paul Bigley say? 12 hours before he captured, BP captured this wave. So in other words, 12 hours, White House released this order 12 hours before BP Earthwatch captured the wave. So it was on the 14th that he captured it. Now we go to my second video. It was September 14, exactly 30 days earlier than BP captured that. I released a second video trying to define to think through this thing of what the whole Lord was saying in this Holy Spirit off the grid, California earthquakes, waves, bombs, etc. So I just, I will leave a link for all of this. I'm only saying this to say that we are beginning to see these waves. Does this mean that we need to just get off the grid right now? You know, no, we don't need to panic. We're not in the panic mode because the Lord would not tell us to panic or anything like that. But this is definitely a heads up. And as Lori says, it is a confirmation of the vision that the Lord gave me. After the first wave, you will be off the grid. That in itself, that one statement that Lori said is something that is interesting to pray about. And that as we seek the Lord, he will define further for us what this means. Because we always pray together and none of us should think that we are above anything. But we as a body pray about these things. It is interesting to see the timing. That is the way that we know the movement of the Holy Spirit is by the timings. So this is very interesting to me. I love you. God bless you and have a blessed day.